Hey there everybody and happy Thursday. This is Grizzly Adams coming at you from a balmy two below zero. It is freezing outside. We've been a little slow on the videoing, but uh, current snapshot, we're working on another tank install and that's going really good despite the cold temperatures. And today I'm gonna be bringing the mini excavator over to our job where the backhoe is at. Mariah and Swanberg are working on leach field repairs and all kinds of good stuff. Getting ready for a tank installation tomorrow. So we'll take you over there and you can see what that looks like. Yeah, it's going, uh, going good. So this job that we're doing is for our good friends, Brad and Christine, amazing people, really excited uh, to handle their tank install for them and doing some work to their old leach fields, pretty old system out there. So some of the old pipes were unreliable and the engineer deemed it necessary to replace some of those pipes so he could have a more accurate snapshot of the current condition and adequacy of the existing leach field in conjunction with a new septic tank replacement. So we are working away on that. It's a pretty deep system. So this is one of those systems where you need to be very careful, take your time, do a really good job, be very safe with the deep holes, large rocks, pretty uh, gravelly, cobbly, boulder type soil. Well, you can come along with me and we'll go pick up the excavator and safely get that over to the job site. So we're gonna need to chain up, it's a pretty uh, heavy excavator. But we got the Super Duty F-350, so we're gonna be all right. We're gonna throw all 950 foot-pounds of torque at it. It's gonna be good. Here we go. Have you ever tried filming and putting on tire chains with one hand with no gloves on at three below? No. All right, guys, chains are on. I wanted to chain or I wanted to film the whole process, but it's freezing out here. Sorry. Let's get this trailer and get out of here. All right, guys, we are all chained up. Got a heavy load. Uh, just gonna play it safe going down the steep hill. Because it's the right thing to do. Here we go. Oh, I'm glad I chained up. Definitely a good call. Okay. Well, guys, that was definitely very, very hairy, to say the least. Yeah, a little pucker. <sighs> and that is exactly why Armed Services invests in PWAG tire chains. If you think you might need to chain up, you absolutely need to chain up. Case in point. I think that 13,000 pound excavator and 4,000 pound trailer would have pushed me right down that icy hill without chains. Trader brakes actually worked pretty good too. Okay, on to the job. It is four below zero right now. The sun, rather, is disappearing. 
out of sight. It's about to get really cold tonight. It might be a 10 below type of night. All right, well, we made it over here without incident. Four below. Hey there, buddy. You helping? What's up, buddy? Oh my goodness, it's cold out there, guys. Well, delivery is complete. Got the excavator over there. Let's see, what are we at here? Still negative four. Cold enough for me, that is for sure. All right, now I just gotta get back up the icy driveway without chains, I think we'll do fine. All right guys, back to the yard, safe and sound. Delivery is complete, beautiful night cold it's supposed to be warming back up so i'm excited for that all right i'm gonna call the day here how's it going good how's your voice doing i'm losing it are you whispering I'm there you go during the heat of the day it is seven below all right seven below here during the middle of the day i didn't see what the low was last night i imagine probably at least and below so yeah equipment's definitely moving slow we're continuing to work through hurdles um, had a weird filter plug up on our 2020 caterpillar and the guys are working with cat service department get it taken care of and so far they uh, seem to always take really good care of us and make anything right so working on that uh, other crew you know at seven below everything is so frozen up <laughs> it's, it's hard to get things moving and even things as simple as locks freezing up and constant de-icing and whatnot so yeah that's uh, part of the part of working here in alaska so it's good <coughs> so mariah and i are going to go take robbie <coughs> to a friend's house for a few hours and she and I are going to go take a couple hours to hang out with each other and have some fun in the Matsu Valley. So that's what we're doing today. <laughs> <laughs> 